90 Day Fiancé contestant since she initially popped up on reality television a few years ago. Karine Martin still first appeared on 90 Day Fiancé before the 90 Days in 2017 and 2018 as her romance with Paul Stale developed, her IMDb page detailed. Then the following year, she joined 90 Day Fiancé the other way. New reports regarding Karine's personal life suggests she has a new romance blossoming while also battling for custody of her kids. Karine and Paul have had a tumultuous relationship. They got married in November 2017 and have since welcomed two sons, Pierre and Ethan. Allegations of cheating and abuse floated around, which even led to rumours TLC had dropped them from the franchise. They remained together to some extent until December 2021, when a video showing Kareen allegedly physically abusing Paul emerged. The two 90 Day Fiancé stars have moved back and forth since between Brazil and the United States a couple of times since first connecting online. Kareen added that Child Protective Services took her boys' passports and made it very clear my children will not return to Brazil where they were born. In the five days since beginning the GoFundMe page, Kareen has raised $1,845 towards her goal of $5,000. 90 Day Fiancé star fights to regain custody of her boys. She has opened herself up to find love again as well, who has previous connections to both The Bachelorette and 90 Day Fiancé. Citer was on Caitlin Bristow's season of The Bachelorette back in 2015. He was eliminated during the first week and later romanced Yolanda Leak from season four of 90 Day Fiancé before the 90 days. Cinema Blend noted he also dated Love After Lockup star Lizzie Coombs and there were rumours regarding a romance with season eight 90 Day Fiancé personality Amira Lalisa as well. Citer and Kareen initially connected via Instagram not long ago, detailed in touch. A source shared they immediately made a connection and the romance has built quickly. He travelled from his home in Chicago to Louisville, Kentucky on November the 3rd so they could meet face to face for the first time. And apparently, the romantic sparks were strong in person too. The past few years have certainly been a wild ride for the 90 Day Fiancé star and people will be curious to see what comes next for her.